I really try to operate from a place of not knowing. I want to get in there and I want to basically let everything come to me. Uh, you know, sometimes a choreographer wants to have uh, everything prepared ahead of time, but I really, uh, at this point in my professional career, I really try to go into the studio and uh, just operate from that place of not knowing. So if the dancers are in front of me, I feel like, okay, I'm going to use their energy and let, let them inspire me. You know, who they are as a person, that gives, you know, a dynamic, a different element that I couldn't come up with on my own. That's what's really important to me is to, is to be a part of something that's bigger than myself. And when I look at it, when, it, when, it's, uh, when it's finished, many times I feel like, uh, did I do that? Or where did that come from? Or That makes it special. It makes it very special to me. It makes it special for me to be a part of something like that, you know? I had the music already uh, finished. It happens to be my brother-in-law, uh, Jonathan Dougal, and his music is fabulous. And, I love working with him and he actually lives in Atlanta, I live in Philadelphia and we're, you know, many late nights actually just talking on the phone and he'll send me something and I'll say, no, slow this down and can you speed this up and, you know, but he, what he comes up with is absolutely beautiful and inspiring for me. So I was in the studio with, with Courtney and, you know, uh, we were going through the beginning of the music and, uh, you know, I, we came up with, you know, some, some movement and she was, uh, obviously she starts, you know, uh, on the floor, it's very earthy and, and I, I had her, you know, brush her hands and I said, you know, you know, brush like you're in sand, you know, like throw the sand up in the air. And it, it basically just started from there. I had, you know, no preparation of, uh, you know, wanting to do something uh, on location or in the sand. I was just simply creating. and. And that's, that's basically how it started. And I happened to uh, see TJ performing somewhere. And, and so what I thought was going to be a solo, um, you know, I talked to him and I saw him perform and he was dynamic and just, you know, what a, an incredible uh, a dancer. And just the energy and the rawness that comes off of him uh, is just something that I was like, oh, can I, you know, can I work with this guy? And so it became a duet. So when it started as a solo, it became a duet. We were able to actually find a place on location, which took a, took a while, but we found this magnificent uh, site. And uh, uh, sand also uh, means something to me personally. Um, I have, you know, some Middle Eastern uh, background, and uh, culture is very important to me. Um, you know, it, it's something that's ancient. It's it's people of ancient cultures sitting around the fire and talking or dancing and, and, and celebrating their life, no matter how difficult it may be, um, what you're going through uh, at this particular time in your life, it's a celebration. It's a celebration of, of who you are, the pain, the joy, everything, all of the human element. It, to be able to, uh, at the end of the night, uh, wherever you are, celebrate the day. You're celebrating that day. You're celebrating that you're alive. Even if it's, it, there's so much pain, you're, you're getting it out, you're releasing it. That's what's so important is to release whatever it is you're feeling, not to keep it inside, to be vulnerable, to be transparent. And that's healing. That's where a lot of uh, this particular work um, comes from that area. I'm operating from that uh, mentality and thought process. You know, my hopes are that when uh, my work is seen, uh, people can relate to that and say, you know, yeah, I, I that that makes sense to me. You know, it, it, it's not about a genre. It's not about uh, a particular style. It's about communication. If one person in the audience can recognize that, whatever that audience may be, then, then I feel, you know, I, I feel complete at that point. You know, I feel complete with the process at that point.